So you might have seen these cars around Amazon's events, Oracle claiming that they can save you 50% on your AWS bill. You know what? I don't want to disparage the Oracle cloud infrastructure solution because it's a decent solution. They have things that I'm really interested in. One, the ability to handle the enterprise change management motions. So they'll take applications that AWS might have a little bit trouble supporting, i.e. Oracle Rack from a cost perspective. And then uh, they have this great non-blocking network. In theory, you get the complete amount of bandwidth leaving a bare metal machine. They have a pretty decent bare metal service. But from a cost comparison, you know, this is comparing apples to oranges. I'll give you an example of transportation. Comparing a motorcycle to a car. If I live in a warm client climate, I'm a single person, I only need to transport one person back and forth. A motorcycle is cheaper transportation than a car. However, however if I'm a family of four and I need to go multiple places, it's a uh, rainy, cold climate, then a motorcycle, doesn't matter how much money you'll save for transporting one person, it doesn't fit my needs. Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, if it fits your needs, is a pretty decent solution. Amazon AWS, wow, you know what? The number, uh, the sheer number of re regions where the service is at, and then the sheer number of services. If you've built a Lambda-based application and you've uh, based that off of events occurring in S3, et cetera, you, simply can't move that to Oracle Cloud infrastructure. They don't have the comparable services. So while yes, from a virtual machine to virtual machine instance, AWS may be cheaper. I mean, uh, Oracle Cloud may be cheaper than AWS, but from a just pure capability being able to do what I need to get done, Oracle Cloud just may not be a solution for you. But I encourage you to go over to Oracle Cloud to check them out. They, they're not sponsoring it. I, I, I like the solution for what it is, but I'm not about to abandon or advise customers to start aban abandoning AWS in lieu of it for saving 50% in certain use cases. If you have any questions, you can follow me on the web. TheCTOAdvisor.com is the website. You can follow me on Twitter at CTOAdvisor, or you can send me an email, Keith at TheCTOAdvisor.com. Talk to you next CTO Dose.